At Metro Vancouver's Waste to Energy facility, a five-story tall structure has been added to the side of the building. It contains electromagnetic technology that can separate valuable metals from the bottom ash. Bottom ash is the residue of the waste combustion process. It's the ash that falls to the bottom after waste is incinerated. This facility handles about one quarter of the region's waste that can't be recycled. The bottom ash is cooled and conveyed to bunkers. Then, magnetic metals, also known as ferrous metals, like iron, are routinely removed by passing under a magnetic extractor. Also in 2018, the extraction of non-ferrous metals from bottom ash began. Non-ferrous metals include valuable materials like aluminum and copper. A device called an eddy current separator sends an electric current through the passing load. Non-ferrous metals are briefly magnetized so that they are repelled and fly into a separated area at the back end of the chute. The remaining reduced amounts of bottom ash are then sent to landfill or used in cost-saving and beneficial applications such as replacing aggregate materials as building foundation in Metro Vancouver projects.